Hey guys, today for our 2024 election prediction, we are going to, um, well actually I, I'm actually not doing a 2024 election prediction, I'm doing an alternate history video for the first time in a while, I used to um, always do them, I, I used to like to, to do them, but then I got into 2024. So this alternate history election, or election uh, matchup, is between Donald Trump, the Republican candidate, and Barack Obama. Now this is supposed to take place in 2016. I Trump's the Republican nominee, and I'm just going to assume, or I'm just going to um, take into effect, um, basically, allow Barack Obama to run for a third term. Okay, I'm going to say there's no rules about running for a third term, and Barack Obama is running for a third term. He His two terms has passed. He's not, like, you know, running for his first term. He never served. His two terms has passed. He's running for a third, and he's running against Donald Trump. Hillary Clinton ran against Donald Trump in 2016, and as we know, she won the popular vote but lost the electorate. Alright, so let's get started. Barack Obama will win his home state of Illinois. He will win safe Democratic states. Oregon, Washington, California, um, Hawaii, no changes here. Um, he could definitely win New York, Connecticut, New Jersey, Delaware, um, Joe Biden's home state of, uh, yeah, Joe Biden, his running mates home state of Delaware, um, Maryland, which he will only, I don't think he would carry that much of, um, of Maryland, not as much as places in safe democratic states like Delaware, like New York, like Illinois, I think it would be, um, let's see, it would be likely, and then there's lean and tilt, so there's solid likely lean and tilt, and then, uh, Rhode Island will be safe, Massachusetts will, Vermont will, New Hampshire, of course, is usually um, lean or tilt. In this matter, I will put tilt on it. Um, here, let me get his. Or actually, yeah, Obama won it in 2012. Um, so I think he would do the same. I think Obama would carry the first district in the, of Maine, and Trump would carry the second. I think Obama would win Maine at large, though, very narrowly or well, lean. I'll put it out. Um, let's see, Virginia, I think Obama would carry the same as Maryland, lean, um, or actually tilt, never mind, tilt. Uh, I don't, hmm, I don't know about North Carolina, I think, uh, Trump would definitely carry West Virginia, no surprise here. You know, North and South Carolina have many black voters, but still, Hillary was nowhere close to winning it in in um 2016 so i still think trump would win it but i will only give it lean because it is such a swing state um yeah yep lean and then there's tilt which is you know if you flip a state barack obama would win dc easily um let's see idaho he'd win wyoming he would win um these are all solid republican states here uh the first i think yeah, Obama would only carry the first district. Oops. Um, you know, maybe he would make some attempt in the second, so I'll make it tilt. Um, or lean, I mean, or whatever it is, I forget. Obama would carry Minnesota, I think, as Hillary Clinton did. Um, there really isn't any much a total uh, African-American minority support here. Um, you know, again, it's very close. Now, Florida... Trump won it in 2016. This was a surprise. This was the turnaround for his campaign. But Barack Obama, he's going to win all minorities, okay, in Florida. Barack Obama will win more minorities than Trump did against Hillary. And Hillary had won 70%. I think Obama could take 80%, but because of that, I think Obama would take minorities in Florida, and he would win it extremely narrowly. It would be tilt. Um, let's see. I, yeah, I think in 2016, he could have carried Georgia. I do think so. I, you know, Hillary Clinton is an extremely weak, um, candidate for when you're looking for minorities to get minority vote. So I think Obama would carry it the same as Georgia. Extremely close. Let's do some Trump states. Uh, I think Trump would carry Iowa. Um, yeah, probably, probably likely, if not lean. Um, or, act, or, I mean, if not solid, he would win Missouri lean, Kansas solid, uh, Utah solid, Obama would, would win Colorado solid, 
let's see, the Rust Belt, Nevada, Arizona, and New Mexico first Trump would take Alaska, though. Um, let's see, I think Arizona is the most swing state of these all, or of them all. Um, New Mexico and Nevada are both more liberal. But Arizona, uh, I think, let's see. Uh, of course, Barack Obama did not win in 2008. Here, I'm going to get the electoral map. Um, yeah, here, I'm getting the 2012 electoral map here. Um, sorry about this. All right, this is the 2012 electoral map we have here. And, oops, there you are. And we see, uh, yeah, oh, Romney carried Arizona in, 20, in 2012, so that shows you that Obama's pretty weak in Arizona. Um, Obama carried Nevada and New Hampshire, though. But Trump is going to be more popular than Romney in the end, right? I think Trump could take Arizona, but, oh, but Obama's going to be more popular than Hillary. So I think it would work out evenly. I think Obama would take Nevada. And he would also take New Mexico. Um, Obama has already been put over the top. He has been elected for a third term for president of the United States with 278 electoral votes. Only 270 are needed to win. He's eight past. Let's see. Uh, Oklahoma. I think Trump would win Oklahoma. Uh, solid. Arkansas, Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, definitely. Uh, I think, yeah, South Carolina has many black voters. I think it would be lean. I uh, I'll do tilt, or I mean, no, I'll do lean. Before it was tilt. Tennessee uh, is uh, likely. Kentucky is likely. In oh, Indiana solid because Trump's running mate is Mike Pence from Indiana. Um, Ohio is. Oh, Obama won in twenty twelve. Um, yeah, I'll say Obama wins it extremely narrowly, till. Um, let's see, Texas, Trump would win. No change here. Ted Cruz is senator. I'll give it likely. Now let's do the blue wall. The blue wall won the election for Trump in 2016. Let's see if he could do it again. Well, actually, Obama has already won. But, um, Trump, I think Trump could carry... Let's see. Yeah, Obama carried it all in, in 2012. I think he would do it again. I do think so. Um, yeah, Michigan. Michigan lean. And Pennsylvania. Mm, I'll do Pennsylvania, too. So there it is. There's the electoral map. Barack Obama wins in a landslide, actually, against Donald Trump. 342. He only needs 270 to win. Trump only takes 196. Here's the electoral map compared to 2012. There's here. You can see it. Um, looks a, somewhat different. Like in the southern states, um, Obama is going to perform better. But um, yeah. Overall, uh, Barack Obama wins in the landslide. And we see on this graph right here. The red is for Trump, so all red, a solid lean and tilt, um, or solid likely and tilt. There wasn't one lean state. And then the blue is all for Obama. So, yep, um, this has been Trump vs. Obama 2016, and I'll see you all next time.